Oh, yeah, thank you. Hello, you know, hope you're right. Yeah. Your little boy's brave, aren't they? He's brave bringing him to. Oh, does it? Oh, him. <laughs> you him, yes. Oh, these two, yes. This one. You can climb. Oh, climb. Yeah, you hold him, yes. Boys will be boys. That's what I say. Oh, let's take some pictures. It's very narrow, so I can't uh, go quite fast. We're still coming down. Oh, sorry? Oh, no, we're not. We're there. It's a stair as well. Because they're so steep. Come on, let's see. The top is and this is why the stairs are too big compared to the ones in you York Minster. Well. You? You That's why well. you have to be bigger to go up the stairs of most of the churches. Daddy. Because they're pretty spooky dooky. They've done very well, don't they? Well, well, everyone's well, doing well, aren't they? Yeah. Did you do the other one where you went down the vertical tap? No, we didn't do that. Oh, I did that one. But uh, you go in backwards on that one. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. So it's not like a ladder. It's looks like a ladder. It goes straight down. Yeah, into the... Where they sacrifice the Templars. Yeah. Oh. The Knights Templars, they took them there. We're all doing very well, aren't we, everybody? Yeah. Do you want to? Are you are you with? The, are you all together? Yeah. That's all right. I didn't know whether you wanted to come up again. Thank you. Are you going up? Are you? No, it's not. I'll follow these two. Up the way there, please. There we go. Off you go. I, I noticed there's some people on top of the cathedral. <laughs> I wanted to do that one, but you had to pay extra to do that. Well, I didn't mind, but you know, I thought they would let me climb it, you know. <laughs> right, we're in the lookout tower of the castle. I've done all that bit. Oh, I pray for you. Were waiting and I will let you no, out. No. <laughs> Didn't see you hiding around the corner. Yeah, there's more people hiding up there. 
Right, I'm going to walk back the other way now. I'm going to walk it in reverse now. Yeah, I don't blame you. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not doing all the ladders. <laughs> Right, we might be able to do a video because there's not so many people now. So I can video walking around the castle, around the ramparts. Then I'm going to go inside, like, go and visit places like in there. Yeah, I don't have to stop and do lots of photos, so I'll just um, literally walk around the castle. Lucy's Tower on top of the keep there where people were also buried in the past I think they might have um, I've got all the history in the booklet this is to stop people climbing up see this glass stops people climbing up So there we are. Well, I've just been in the lookout tower. There's the prison. <clears throat> I've done very bitty videos so I thought I'd do one completely on the way back without going into lots of detail. Then I'm gonna get get in that shop. We've got three hours yet. So I thought what I'd do is um I'm going on a ghost walk tonight. There's the courthouse. Four vans there now. And this is where some people are buried. Some of the prisoners here. The lost prisoners. Sit here for a second, have a drink of water, I think. Oh, it's quite big. It's quite big, actually, the inside of this keep. This is Lucy's keep. I've been lucky with the weather, you know. Very lucky. It rained at night the other night, so but it did, hadn't rained in the day. And I finished all this, I think, on this one. Finished it all. Let's just do it, uh, 20 again. The observatory tower. I just did that, yeah. Now I'm back in. Lucy's Tower. 1822. Jailkeeper John Merriweather prepares to climb to the top of the observatory tower to indulge in his greatest passion, astronomy. The tallest section of the tower was added as part of a rebuilding and renovation program around 1820. Although its initial purpose is unclear, it serves as a watchtower to help prevent the escape of prisoners. Its height also makes it the perfect spot for Merryweather's telescope, which may be one of the reasons why it's subsequently referred to as the Observatory Tower. The base of the tower stands on a second mont or man-made hill, which was built in the 12th century, about a hundred years later than the first one. The stone keep tower that was constructed upon it became along with the Lucy Tower, one of the castle's most imposing structures. In the 19th century, this already impressive building was topped by an additional turret. In the 1840s, a former inmate recalled his incarceration 20 years before and the prison governor's keen interest. He had a handsome mounted telescope and frequently spent whole nights in stargazing. A very proper employment, I thought, for the governor of a prison. One or two desperate attempts at escape 
had been promptly foiled by his vigilance. In the 20th century, the tower was put to much more important use during the Second World War. With its roofing closed with a timber and glass structure, it acted as a vital observation post during the Luftwaffe's nighttime raids. Volunteers from the civil defence, many only in their teens, watched through binoculars for any incidents such as fires or explosions. They then used a rangefinder and a map to establish their exact position and reported them to the authorities. A rope hanging down from the tower as a fire escape was often used by the messengers as a quick way down to ground level when they didn't want to take the stairs. Bomber Command also had many airfields situated in Lincolnshire. The cathedral and the castle were distinctive and useful landmarks for the pilots as they returned home from a mission. If you wish to climb to the top of the tower and enjoy the wonderful view, make your way to the top of the stairs behind you. Please remember to be considerate to fellow visitors. Otherwise, please leave the tower, turn right and make your way to the courtyard where you began your tour. Once there, look for the final audio guide symbol and press 21. following in the footsteps of history while walking the walls of Lincoln Castle. Please return your multimedia player to its collection. Don't forget, before you leave, to visit the Victorian prison for a vivid glimpse into the life of a prisoner during the Victorian era. And of course, Lincoln Castle is also the only place in the world where you can find an original copy of Magna Carta from 1215, together with the Charter of the Forest issued in 1217. You'll find them in the specially built David P.J. Ross Magna Carta Vault. Thank you to the Dean and Chapter of the Cathedral. You can explore Magna Carta through the Wall of Words and a stunning 210 degree cinema screen with a film explaining its story and significance. Many thanks for visiting Lincoln Castle today. We hope to see you again soon. Goodbye. That's the prisoner vans leaving after they've been to court. I was up in that tower over there a minute ago. Well worth I'm doing a re I'm doing extras, I'm doing an extra. Well I do hope to have time to go in the prison. And if I don't if I fill up to it, I'm going on a ghost walk tonight. around uh, the town, around the medieval bit, I think. That's plan A, but it's quite hot. That's the old mental hospital down over there, the big mansion at the back. Amazon. Amazon, I'm, sure she was called. I'm just thinking of the woman that introduced me to that as the mental hospital and told me about the history and the statue that's within the wood there and how there never used to be trees there and there were beautiful views.
We have a copy of that, haven't we? That's the water tower. Apparently the water was so bad in Lincoln at one point with lots of diseases and stuff that they had to build, um, they built a great big water tower to help improve the water system. I noticed everyone who's out this afternoon have been given earphones, but well, we never got them this morning. Mine was playing out loud. Yeah, I thought you normally got earphones with them. What you want to do I want a cup really, or in a tea towel, or a night. <sighs> I'll have a good fry up on Just stop, I'm just planning ahead. Um, I got the video running, so I've got to get a souvenir. I'm doing double, most people only walk around it once. I come, got there and came back. With the cathedral in front of me, which I couldn't, I didn't spend the extra, would have cost me another £20 to have done that. So I, I decided on the castle being, but I did, I did tour the cathedral, but I never got up in the roof or the tower. Nearly there now. Nearly back. I'm on my way back. I've been there and coming back the same way. Oh, is it up Yeah, you can get off over there where you, where you, you know. Yeah, you can get you can get off where you started. Well, I went came back because I thought I'd do it. it's a different view. When you do anything in reverse, it's different, isn't it? Well, you can do that if you want, but then you meet different people. I bet you know I never met you earlier. Oh, was I? Yeah. Then I had to go and put more money in the car. Then I had to have a tweet. with a little one because I don't can't carry so much. I've got a small one in my pocket, a little Sony. And that is really good, my Sony. And I've got a mobile. Yeah. But as long as it shoots something, I don't really care really. I'm not a I'm not the BBC. <laughs> Yeah, I know, I know. I did have much better Sony's in the past. Really good. Yeah. You could pick a flea off a bird up right up there. They were really good. But both of them need repair now because they're so ultra sensitive. Yeah. When they go wrong, they could it cost you five hundred pounds to get it repaired. Yeah, that's what we found to have our well, you know, 
this well this is it but i've kept them i thought one day somebody might want to repair it there's probably something little tiny thing in there well when i bought 